Hey, it's Brian Grams here at the Bolo Auto Museum, and today we're going to talk about this hearse behind me. Uh, you're probably wondering why it's loaded with bullet holes. It's from the movie Terminator 3. Uh, if you remember the graveyard scene when Arnold comes walking out with a big coffin on his uh, shoulder, throws it into the back of the car, and then takes off through the graveyard while being shot at by a SWAT team. That's how all the bullet holes ended up in the car. Now the way they did this is they punctured all these holes in the car before production. Then they filled it with a plastic explosive and painted the car black. So they had a guy with a switchboard that would ignite all these little explosives to make them look like bullets hitting the car as they're going down the screen. Now they used about six different hearses to film that scene and they used kind of like a build sheet so that they could get the cars identical. All the placement of the bullet holes were the same between all the cars. They wanted it to appear as one car, and that's something that's very crucial is the placement. So we actually found one of these build sheets in this car when we purchased it that showed the production company where the bullet holes needed to be placed. Now you can see this and a lot of other different TV and movie cars here at the Volo Auto Museum. We're open seven days a week, year round, from 10 until five. You can follow us on Facebook. You can also go to our website, which is volocars.com.